Uh, good morning and thank you. It's a pleasure to be here today, a model of, of mathematics. I have a formula, I'll call it 3P, that we used in fighting the Exxon Valdez oil spill. China's economic gains and accomplishments are being marred by the cheating of a handful of people, greedy, unscrupulous, soulless pirates who threaten your reputation, economic future, as well as economic futures of generations around the world. We saw a copy of Ocean's 12. Now, Ocean's 12 has not been released any place in the world yet. $5,000. If I invest the same $1,000 in heroin trafficking, like pills like Viagra, copied throughout China, exported around the world, the penalties are incredibly low, despite the risk of lives. As well. When you buy counterfeit pharmaceuticals, you lose your lives. And in China, the piracy rate of pharmaceuticals is estimated at 20 to 50 percent for some popular brands. Clubs. A club like this, which just came out about two weeks ago in the U.S., would retail for over $600 at the lower end. We don't doubt the resolve of our partners in Beijing. Copies of a DVD in, say, one or two languages. When you see a DVD with eight language tracks. Well, I'm, I was around Beijing as well, examining lotteries. Some I found were legitimate. Some I thought, you know, were a little dodgy, a little shaky. But again, you know, from the golf club example, it's not hard to find the materials. It's not hard to find the pirate. So people say that, you know, we're working hard on it. That's, that's simply not satisfactory. We're seeing a chorus around the world of other companies, other countries, WTO members, are all asking, when will we jointly bring a WTO action against China? Facilities. I like, here it is. Except there's facilities in Houston, Texas. Is the nature of the piracy. This is what happens with a manufacturer of an important product that. So here's Whoa, who did that? I just did. Oh, okay. Shoot. No, it had been, been 